Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Maybe you might remember that I used to own a 1972 Chrysler New York uh, Coupe. Unfortunately, I sold it in November 2020. But today I met a guy who owns the almost exact same car, only it's a four-door. Hi guys, today we look at a 1972 Chrysler New York, a Brom with a 440 engine. It is here in Germany and the proud owner is unfortunately not me. His name is Johannes and uh, well, he's really uh, proud and I can understand because the car is in well, almost perfect condition. Look at the seats. Um, the back seats are original. The front seats, uh, he has redone them, but uh, in an absolute original way. Dashboard has no cracks. Everything works as far as I could find out. Uh, Johannes says the paint is original and um, I believe it, but look how it shines in the sun. Well, the uh, Chryslers 1969 through 1973 were in the fuselage design. Look at this sensor between the lights. I don't know what they are for. Maybe someone knows. Of course, what is not original is this black stripe uh, in the middle. Some previous owner covered up some scratches, I guess. But that doesn't hurt the appearance. So let's have a closer look at the car. What I especially like about the car, it doesn't have a B pillar, so it's a real hard top sedan. That doesn't exist anymore today. And of course it's the Brougham. And now let's have a look inside the car. It has all the options for power windows, even power vent windows. We'll have a look at these later on. I think the condition is really great where well, there's one little crack in the steering wheel. Johannes has redone the front seats. It's really the car is wonderful. Look at the power vent windows. I've never seen that. Well, I've, I know them in Lincolns. They uh, go down and here they go in and out. So let's have a look under the hood. It has the 440 engine, the 7.2 liter. And I think the engine base speaks for itself. Well, something must have been done to the engine because it accelerates like crazy.
So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. So make sure to subscribe to my channel. There's many more videos and maybe you even find the videos of my 72 coupe.